Yo, how's it going guys and welcome back to another video on the channel. In today's video we are going to be focusing on the Premier League upgrade packs. Yes, they are here, the premium Premier League upgrade packs. We also have the league packs for I think every major league, which is decent guys, which is decent. So in this video we are going to be opening at least 50. We have this account, which is a friend's account, so a big thank you to him. And I also have a bunch on my account, which I'm not sure whether I'm going to save for another video. I think it depends on how this one goes. But well, before we get into it, if you enjoyed today's video, smash like down below and subscribe for a lot more FIFA 21 content. I'm just going to take a look at these SBCs to talk you through how I'm going to approach these SBCs. Because this account is in a very similar position to mine, 600,000 coins. Now, I personally love these SBCs. I think last year I probably gambled 1 to 1.5 million, maybe even 2 million into these SBCs. And what I like about them is EA usually release really good SBCs around Team of the Year. For example, the Frank Ribery, he is overpriced, but a top card. Dybala, a very, very nice card, only two segments. And you complete maybe 10 of these Premier League upgrade packs. Then once you've actually opened them, you go to the upgrade section over here, go to the five, uh, sorry, the two rare gold players pack, put your common players in that, and then just repeat the cycle. I think it costs around 5,000 coins to actually do... Um, each Premier League premium upgrade recycle. So every go at one of these packs is 5,000 coins. If you work it out, you can actually have a really nice chance of getting some something decent, whether that's a team of the year or whether that is just fodder for your team. It just depends on how your look is. But with the Bruno Fernandes SBC being out, you could work towards that. With the Ribery, Dybala, future SBCs, maybe we'll get one in 20 minutes. We will have to see, guys. But today we have 15 of these. Hopefully we can get something good. I mean, a Paul Pogba, Bruno Fernandes, Kevin De Bruyne, team of the year. Let's get it. We're going to go for number six in the first one. Why not? Four. Bruno Fernandes, let's go. I don't know why number six when he's number 18. But in the first one, we get a board. So we'll take a board. Can it be a Marcus Rashford French? It's going to be striker. Who is this? Lacazette. So 83 Lacazette in the first one. You take those and Cody. And you see all the non-rares. What you want to do is just stick them into the gold upgrade pack. Okay, next one. Then we'll go for just a random one. Hopefully we can get something good. I mean, I do like these SBCs. I think the best thing I've packed from these SBCs in the past has been a Romelu Lukaku team of the season when he was at Everton, and he was phenomenal. We get Rodrigo, and this is where it's also stacks up development. Sacco, if you want to be very, very um, efficient, go to the gold upgrade. Obviously checking the club if they are actually tradable or not. In this case, we'll just get rid of them, and then we'll just, if it stacks up, I'll start to put them through the gold upgrades, but with two, I normally just wait until there's a couple of them. Walkout, come on, purple. Oh, there's first walkout, though. It's going to be French. Kante. N'Golo Kante, there we go. So we do pack an N'Golo Kante, and that is a very, very nice start, because if you've got ten of these and you get N'Golo Kante, there are your coins back, guys. There are your coins back, so... We take those, that's a fantastic start to the uh, session of opening these packs. And yeah, again, I'll probably, wait, no, surely not. Oh yes, that's huge, that is huge. 100,000 coins right there. Thank you very much, Ian. thank you very much. And we can discard him because we've got 100,000 coins from the pack. Let's go, it wasn't the team of the year, but that is an absolutely fantastic pull. N'Golo Kante, and it just depends on what you need for your team as to which league upgrade SBCs you actually want to grind. Because for me on my account, I already have is that a Ziyech. That's decent, 85. I already have a Neymar, I have an Mbappe. Obviously with Mbappe, um, team, of the, team of the year, I would quite like to get that in the team. But we already have an untradable Mbappe, already have an untradable Neymar. So them two players are out of the way. With Premier League, it just depends on what your team needs. You might want Lewandowski, you might want Kimmich. Go for the Bundesliga upgrade instead. But me personally, I'm going to stick to the Premier League. I think with the full team, we have Van Dijk, we have Trent, we have Bruno Fernandes, and we also have um, Kevin De Bruyne. But we do have a lot of duplicates here. I'll go in there, sort these out, and we'll be right back to it. So there we go. We've sorted out the duplicates. And let's get back to it, guys. 11 more to go. I've just crafted another one. So... Yeah, it's almost just like an endless cycle if you can have the coins to back up doing these SBCs. And I think that over the next week or two, I'm going to be doing as many as possible of these, getting as many videos as I can to you guys, as we have even more duplicates. And um, yeah, in this case, I'm just going to discard them just for the sake of this video. But if we keep getting them, I will try to be as efficient as possible. But hopefully he lets me off since we did get him. And then go look, Ante. 
Come on here. I did one on the companion app. I think if you're building them, the companion app is the best way to go. That's a decent pack. McNeil as the only duplicate there. Lamella is the best player, which is not ideal. Um, but yeah, we just want decent, decent fodder at this stage. I mean, team of the year would be beautiful. EA Sports, if you're listening. An info Pogba would be nice. Um, yeah, and we get Maguire, and I'll put these in an SBC. Why not? So I put the gold commons into the gold upgrade SBC. And yeah, you could get incredibly lucky with this one. I've never had really too much luck with the two gold rare upgrade SBC. But you never know, Yolo could be in. It's a board. We're going to skip it because I pressed it by accident because I thought it was nothing. We get a Joe Gomez. Please be tradable. He's not tradable. I'll let him know that he's gone to the Gulag. A Joe Gomez, an 83 rated card. You probably want to put into maybe a Paolo Dybala, maybe the smaller sections of the Icon SBC. That's how I'm going to grind it out, and hopefully we just get better and better SBCs as Team of the Year does continue, guys. This pack, though, we keep getting McNeil, and when it's just three, I'm just going to discard them. Um, but eight more to go. Will we see a Team of the Year? I think we've seen more than good enough to be satisfied with the 15 that we did start off on, and Angola Kante, it probably is the coins back in value. I need to work out how much... Um, they do cost per pack, but Ku Falkeen, let's do the let's do the grind, guys. You never know the gold upgrade we could do from this could bring us, I don't know, could bring us Kimmich. All right, here we go. Two more rare gold players packs. You never know. As I say, these ones are just not the best. But at the end of the day, it's giving two rare gold players back to the club, which we can then put in our desired league SBC. But Campbell and Arnold, that is probably what you can expect from these two gold upgrade packs. But yeah, will we see a team of the year during this pack opening? Will we see a team of the year during this full week? I think last year I didn't pack any team of the years around the actual time of team of the year. Um, our only team of the year was actually towards the end of the year, which was super, super frustrating. I'll just quickly build this one and actually... Yeah, the last time we did get a team of the year was we got N'Golo Kante. You might remember if you're a long-term viewer of the channel. We got N'Golo Kante. We got... Um, Virgil van Dijk, but we already had Virgil van Dijk's team of the season card. It just seemed like they were giving them out for free towards the end of uh, last last FIFA, really. It did seem like they were giving them to uh, to everyone in the packs. But we'll get rid of Kepa, and then the last card we need to actually recycle. If we're going to be careful with these, is actually a Champions League. Have we gone past it? Um, are these not a thing? Yeah. There we go. Champions League rare. Loads of high. And it was Dennis. There we go. An extra one because we were... Um, yeah, we were good with the recycling. We were good. We were recycling the, the players into the SBC. We get premium Premier League players. And let's go. Let's just pack a team of the year. I want to see that purple flare. I'm quite glad that they changed the flare this year. With it being a blue flare last year, we could have got a Champions League card and we would have thought it was a team of the year. At least this time, when it's a walkout, you need to see that purple flare, guys. The purple flare... Of dreams, especially with it being just midfielders in packs, you know that you've got something absolutely phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal. You've either got Kevin De Bruyne, obviously you've got a Bruno Fernandes, one of which goes for like 2.2 million, one of which goes for maybe 4 million, which is just crazy. I used the team of the Bruno in the foot draft the other day, and he was amazing. He was absolutely amazing. Haven't used De Bruyne, but we're going to get Dutch left mid, that is Bergvine. 83 rated Bergvine, which is decent. You can put him in a nice little SBC. Um, these ones seem to be tradable, which is quite weird. Um, but we'll just send him up, get rid of them too. And how many do you have left? I think this is just going to be one account for today, guys. I'm not sure if I'm going to save mine because I really cannot hold on to packs. It's just like the worst thing for me. I cannot hold on to any packs at all. I would, I wish I saved all my packs for Thursday when the, potentially the whole of the team of the OIS in packs. Get Ozil and Matic, right? Let's recycle. Six more then. Come on, EA Sports. Give us something good in these last six. Make it worthwhile. Another couple walkouts would be nice. I mean, we've been starved of the walkouts. Only Kante. Board, Portuguese, right back. Senamed is that. Yeah, it's Moutinho. 83 Moutinho. And I seem to pack him all of the time. Come on, here, Please be tradable. At least a couple of them. Yeah, this is not the most efficient way, guys. But again... It is just for the sake of this video, and we have, we've, we've had some good luck with this, uh, with this so far. Walkouts seem to have ran out though, which is kind of disappointing. If you think of Thursday, Virgil Van Dijk, we've got the likes of Trent, 
up for grabs as well. Trent will probably be the easiest to pack alongside um, Manuel Neuer. So if you're doing the Bundesliga ones, you could potentially get Manuel Neuer. But it's interesting to see what the prices of Manuel Neuer will be this year with Alisson last year being so, so cheap. He just didn't seem to perform at all. But I think people will pay a premium for a card if it does actually perform up to the sort of levels you expect it to. We get Lacazette again. That's not ideal. It's not ideal in the slightest. Five minutes till... Um, it is the content. So I will grind another one just to see if we get any more content. But yeah, let's see what we get. The final four then. Let's get it. Let's get something good. Come on. A team of the year. I need to see the team of the year flare at least once. I don't care if it's on my account or not. I need to see it. It's a board. Come on, EA. What is this? Portuguese. Not again. Not again. Surely not Moutinho once again. Oh, it is as well. Man, come on. Three more. EA Sports. Come on. Please, pay our team of the year. You never know. We, we never know what the pack could be. It's not going to be a team of the year in this one. What is this? English? Centre-back, not Gomez again. Man City. Oh, it's John Stones. Not bad. That's decent for us. An informed John Stones. What does he go for? Potentially 30, 20,000 coins. You know what? 20,000 coins. We take it. It is what it is. Uh, yeah, you take that for the photo. Especially if you do it. Do icon packs require team of the weeks? Maybe Paolo Dybala does. Two more, though. And yeah, this has been okay. This has been okay. I definitely think the these are worth grinding. We haven't had the best pack look, but yet still we've come up with an Angolo Kante, a John Stones, a club stock of some decent players as well to put into maybe Icon SBCs, into the League SBCs. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. Over 15 of the new Premier League premium player packs. If you did, smash like down below and subscribe for a lot more FIFA 21 content. Team of the Bruno in the final one. It's not going to be. Unfortunately not. It's not even a board. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you all in the next one.